YouTube, what's up? Trucker Niner back over here with some more Android goodness. Today we're gonna go to our second part of our uh, home launchers. Now, today we're gonna check out ADW launcher. ADW launcher. This is what it looks like. Hopefully you guys could see it there. See, you got the bottom dock. Kind of, there you go. Now, these, um, what I have it set right now is, uh, it's at the honeycomb theme. As you can see, you might not be able to see all, every, every detail there, but like for example, the internet, uh, sign there, the little logo there. That's the that's a honeycomb theme. Then let's see what else we could sh I could show you. Let's check some maps out. Um, the camera, the camera. It's a honeycomb theme. What else we got? Let's see. I think the messaging too, see the messaging here. Messaging is, is honeycomb theme. Now what I had it at before is um uh, it's defaulted. Now what I had it running as before is uh um well just like the other uh, launchers, you could uh set uh, any theme you want. Any theme uh that you want on here. They have a plenty of themes for the ADW. Uh, ADW does uh, is a paid app, and then uh, some of the themes are paid as well. So you might um, consider uh, grabbing the, uh, another launcher if you, you guys don't want to spend any money. But this one is a paid one, and it is uh, it's worth it. It has a lot of uh, awesome settings here. Now, this is what I wanted to show you guys. This is what I had it in. Uh, now, if you want to change your theme, you could go to right there, theme, themes preferences. See, and that's the theme that I have it at right there, Android 3.0 theme. Now, to go to the to select your theme, you download all your themes right on the market. Then you have them all right here. The one that I really like is this one. It's called iFold. Now you just push on your theme. You go all the way down, and it gives you a little sample of what your uh, your your theme's gonna. Uh, I mean, uh, your dock's gonna look like. A little sample there, and then you just go ahead and push apply theme. I think I got it. Might take a little bit. There you go. And as you can see, a little bit different. See the YouTube camera the gmail the maps see a little bit different now what you could do see the music too as you can see now what you could do since ifold is a theme what it lets you do is when you go ahead and hold down the, the icon it lets you edit the icon so you go to edit and then it brings up this custom shortcut right and then what you want to do here is you could either rename it right there you could rename the icon label to whatever you want or you push that little icon right there and it lets you either select pictures select then crop picture or the ADW theme icon pack which you go there and it gives you those three options which I have downloaded from the market and you go to iFold and it gives you a ton a ton of different icons. See? And we show you a little bit better. There we go. See? You have all these different icons. You could set it to whichever one you want. Any app you have. Set it. Look at the little Mario right here. Any. To any of these icons. See? Pretty cool, huh? 
Now you might, I mean, there might be some that you might not, uh, that you might not find, but they're constantly updating it. So um, I'm pretty sure you'll find the main ones, you know, that you're looking for. So yeah, that's the iFold theme for the ADW. Now we go back, and this is the way I have mine set up. See. Uh, that's the row I have now the bottom as you can see it's uh, uh, you get to uh, customize the bottom uh, the dock as you wish and now here's a little cool part now if you do this and I'm sorry if you go up a uh, secret row comes up and this one is scrollable you could add more on there and this is what I have here so now you could always just uh, grab a nap from the market I'm sorry from your drawer and just drag it right on there and it'll just uh, keep I think the maximum is eight applications you could add down there and then if you want to go back you just flick down and that's it easy as that not bad huh now now this one has the same type of a uh, effect as the go launcher see when you scroll through your pages see how it kind of yeah you could always go back to your ADW settings down here ADW settings and then you have all these different different presets UI settings Shh. UI settings and you have general behavior theme preferences now what you want to do here is you could either go to uh, general behavior and then uh, there's there it is right there animation and effects now you could always select all the different uh, types of, uh, of uh, effects that you have uh, transition effects uh, scrolling speeds your desktop bounds so you could always customize it just like the the go launcher or many of the other home launchers that you have um, so for example screen transition effect you have all these other effects I mean they won't give you a uh, sample of what it will do you just have to basically take a pick you know select one say for example we'll go with number five then we just get back out to the main screen and then we'll check it out see what happens we just scroll see what it does there you go pretty cool and then uh, what else can we do um, it also has let's see you could also back up and restore your stuff right there back up and restore themes preference is the same thing just choose your theme there presets you could have uh, iPhone-ish, Nexus-ish, Nexus-ish, Nexus <laughs> Nexus iPhone-ish, default, or, you know, you could always customize it. But, yeah, that's the pretty cool thing about these launchers. You could always customize them any way you like to your preference. Like I said, these are just a few of the launchers that uh, you have... Uh, you have to choose from of course I always I mean I love the sense in the HTC but once in a while I just switch it up you know one eh, once a week I just throw on a different one just you know just to have a cuz it just makes it seem like you know every time you put a new launcher in there like if you have a new phone sometimes you know cuz you, you have a you have a different type of a, a feel for it you know you're you're used to the sense and then you go to a different launcher and it's totally different you know you have to learn it again you know I mean some people not, might not have patience for that but overall um, I like that I mean once in a while I just do you know I like change sometimes I just decide to have a sense this week and then have the go launcher next week and you know but yeah that's where we're at so I have a good one guys and subscribe, comment and make sure you let guys let me know what you guys think about all this. Let me know, I'll get back to you guys.